Hey guys, Adriana Peskid from Orange Real Estate. Welcome to my latest Craigie Burn listing, this amazing street facing refresh townhome, 67 Valley in Crescent in Craigie Burn. Don't forget, like, share, tag someone in this post. I promise they will get to see it before it hits the market. I know you're excited. No stopping. Let's go through and check it out. So, as you can see from the streets, it is a street facing townhouse. It is one of about eight or nine uh, here. You are literally just a stone throw away from Craigieburn Central, which is just up Craigieburn Road, which is just in front of me here. Um, and the access for the garage, which you'll see, is from the rear. It's two bedrooms, one bathroom, uh, dual story. Let's go through and have a look. So, very low maintenance yard. Now, if you're wanting, we've just laid some tan bark here. If you wanted to make this a bit more, you know, nicer, you can lay some artificial grass, plant a nice little garden. You can do that easily. It's actually got a really pretty facade and I love the dark tones that you'll find as you actually walk through the home. So welcome home guys. So as you enter, uh, it is split. I love these homes because they're actually segregated into dining, kitchen and lounge zone. So you walk in and you've got your beautiful, nice, uh, dining zone here at the start of the property. Uh, really good space. So again, this is a nice big six-seater table. Fits perfectly here. You could easily go around table if you want. Um, and again, the reason why I love it set up this way and not lounge in this area is it's just sort of a segue into the kitchen. The other cool feature I love about this dining zone is you actually get loads of natural light. So having nice big windows here is amazing. So you get loads of natural light through the property as well. Block out blinds as well, so they're there for, uh, of course, nice and for privacy. So really good space. We're gonna flick around here into the kitchen. The cool thing about this kitchen, a couple of points. So stone bench top, so 20 mil stone on either side, and it is an island bench. So obviously island bench meaning away from the main kitchen. The cool thing about this obviously is the sink is in this side. You've got dishwasher in this side. Um, so all your prep stuff and your washing up stuff can be done here. As I saw, as I said, dishwasher through here, as you can see. And then you're, you're cooking on this side. So very accessible to cook and wash, which I think is great. You've got gas cooktop through there. You've got a 600 mil oven, which has been beautifully cleaned again. Um, and again, it just, it just it's a nice feel. It's big enough without being too small and or too big for this size uh, townhouse. Fridge space is through here. As you can see, it'll fit in most fridges. Uh, obviously you've got PowerPoint through here. Um, so again, very functional kitchen space. And on the opposite side of the kitchen through here, you'll actually uh, have your European laundry. So just wanna show you through here so you can have a look. You actually get a really good size European laundry. Again, bigger than most uh, for this size townhouse, but trough there. The other thing that you could do easily to add value, and I'll, I'll do this a fair bit, so I'll explain uh, as I go. So because you've got so much space in here, building shelves or cabinetry in here would be something that I would do. Again, to add value, if you're wanting more storage, you could easily do that in here as well. So that is, as you can see, the laundry. Through this way, you've got your beautiful, big, open plan lounge area. Again, it is really warm and inviting. So the, the owners um, just recently, before we got it to sale, um, repainted, recarpeted, which you'll see in a second. We've done new down lights to replace all the old um, halogen lights that are in here. And these are the original uh, laminate timber flooring. So again, they're in still really good nick. You could easily update them as well. Um, the nice brown tones give it a nice warm feel in this zone. And you'll probably see it as you come through, even the night inspections, you'll get that nice warm feeling, but it's a very spacious lounge zone. Like, again, you'll probably see it uh, as you come in. I'm not sure if the camera gets it, but very spacious, good size either, either way. Um, there, you are fitted with a split system. So split system, heating and cooling system downstairs there, which will do all the downstairs area. And you've got a nice tranquil backdrop here. So you've got a nice double door, sliding door, outside into your private courtyard. So obviously we've set it up that you've got a nice little sitting zone here. If you wanted to roof it off, um, some sunshades or whatnot, you could easily do that. Or even those portable umbrellas these days um, would work really, really well because you've got this nice tree in here. You're actually getting nice natural shade anyway. And greenery in the backyard, which I love. Um, and obviously we're in autumn, so the leaves are falling. 
you get all that jazz. And then all we've done is just lay some nice mulch here, clean up the garden beds. You've got a retractable uh, clothesline here, as you can see there. So that obviously goes up. And this is your carport. So it's a garage slash carport. Now they'd say carport because it's roofed and it's not fully enclosed. Carport slash garage. So it is remote control access. It's big enough if you're wanting to really park two cars, you could easily fit two cars tandem driving one car up there and one car down here. You do have side access, so side access to get out from the rear. So just so you know with this street, Champions Parade is there where your actual entry is, but Valley and Crescent is actually behind and that's where the mailboxes are. So that's another little fun fact that you'll see when you get in. So again, nice, practical, very low maintenance courtyard, backyard. Um, and the reason why I like the fact that you've got um, the open carport as such is you can utilize that for entertaining as well. So um, if you're gonna have parties here, having a roof section um, for guests is awesome too. So that's the downstairs uh, section of uh, the unit. And again, we'll just get it from another angle so you can have a look. It's quite a long unit. Um, and again, your location here, uh, you know, to Craigieburn Central is really, you could walk there. Um, so it is fitted with MBN, as you can see there. So that's the MBN Co box. Um, so for those people that want to ask, does it have MBN? Yes, it does. It's straight to the property. We're going to come on upstairs, guys. So these beautiful plush gray carpets. If you've watched many of my videos, you'll know this is my favorite color carpet at the moment. They're really awesome. We're gonna start in the back. So there's two bedrooms up here and both bedrooms for this size townhome are extremely big. Very, very spacious. This is a queen size bed. You could comfortably fit king, even a super king in this room just to show you how big these rooms are. We've obviously done new carpets. We've done new LED lighting. Um, just so you know, the grills, they're for overlook, overlooking um, purposes. So with part of when you're doing developments, you can't look into people's neighbors' yards, so that's what that's there for. But they are fitted with blockout blinds. You get loads of cupboards, but like, have a look. You're getting four, uh, four door, two and two behind the door, which I'll show you. Built-in robes, just to show you how much space. Like, have a look at that. Some shelf space there, hanging space, cupboard space up above. Really, really good size rooms. The rooms are fitted with electric heaters as well. So there's no heating or cooling upstairs other than the electric heaters that are in both rooms. But again, you can add it in here, a couple of split systems, easily done. The other cool thing about this townhouse is it's secondary living zone. So for those people that want to have a little private oasis or after post COVID, a lot of people are working from home a lot more. So having this space as a lounge zone, as a study zone, as a home office is perfect. So that's what we've set up as a dual zone, sitting zone, workspace zone, home office, study zone, whatever the case that you might wanna look there. And then through here, not like it needs more cupboard space, but as you can see there, nice linen cupboard. It's actually a walk-in linen cupboard, which is cool. Um, so lots of shelf space there. Now we're gonna continue through into the bathroom, so the central bathroom is only one bathroom through here, but that there will cater to everything that you could need. Nice uh, stainless steel frame shower. You've got vanity there, you've got bath tucked around the corner. So for those people that have kids, um, or someone that just loves to have a bath of an evening, bathtub right there. The other cool feature is that it does have a separate toilet to this side, so people can use the toilet and the bathroom at the same time which I think is cool. And then the final room that I'm gonna show you is the master. So again, very spacious, light-filled master. Again, bigger than the second bedroom. Um, obviously, you get a bit more space. Queen-size bed, again, you could easily fit even a nice little study in the corner. We've obviously set it up. It's got a nice little couch zone in the corner. Again, really awesome space. Loads of natural light coming in. I'm gonna show you in a second. This one actually has smaller wardrobes. So this has got a three door wardrobe through here. One, two, and three with hanging space and shell space. It does come with the heater there, as you can see. So electric heater. And this one, you actually get a nice outdoor balcony, sitting zone, 
morning zone, you're going to have your coffee out here. So this is basically uh, your nice little balcony off your uh, master. And as I said, so Craigie Bend Central, literally just head up this street and turn right, you'll be there in two minutes. It's literally up the road. Everything is really, really close. Restaurants, shopping, cafes, eateries, petrol stations now. There's quite a few uh, up on Craigie Bend Road as well. Um, and you're very, very central to everything. So uh, again, it's an amazing townhome. The owners have spent some money in getting it to move in ready, which I find awesome. So that way you don't have to spend a cent. Everything's been done. Carpet's been done. Lighting's been done, painting's been done. You just have to back your furniture in here and enjoy this beautiful town home. Uh, as I said, street facing, walking distance to everything. Uh, so hopefully you enjoy the tour, guys. I know it's impressive enough. Come and check it out in person, I promise. It always looks better in person when you walk through. Um, if you've got any questions about this home or any of our homes, as always, you can give me a call anytime, 0402 Please jump on our social pages, Facebook, Instagram, um, or subscribe to our YouTube channel, or now even follow us on TikTok. We've started on TikTok, we've been doing that for a little bit now, where you'll find a range of uh, content, not only properties for sale, properties for lease, but also anything real estate. Um, there's plenty of stuff that we, we post on, on a regular basis. And don't forget, like I said, like us, follow us, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, alternatively, if you're thinking of selling your home, doesn't have to be in Craigieburn, guys. We sell right around Melbourne and even into regional Melbourne now. Feel free to give myself and the team a call anytime. We'd love to help. Again, 0402 055 437. Thanks for taking the time and having a tour, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I look forward to meeting you at one of our open homes.